Okay, Hillary Clinton crying while reading the acceptance speech she would have given in 2016 is absolutely she broken She still me. found a way to offer me the boundless love and support she never received herself. She taught me the words of our Methodist faith. Do all the good you can for all the people you can in all the ways you can as long as ever you can. I think about my mother every day. Sometimes I think about her on that train. I wish I could walk down the aisle. Uh -huh. I wish I could walk down the aisle. You fucked loser. Aisle and find the little wooden seats where she sat, holding tight to her even younger sister, alone, terrified. She doesn't yet One know person. how much she will suffer. She doesn't yet know she will find the strength to escape. Bro, who the fuck pays to listen to this, by the way? First of all, I'm just gonna say it, okay? If you're paying to like listen to Hillary Clinton, who is a fucking loser, what are you learning about the master class in losing? Is that what you're doing? Is that are you learning about how to is this a master class in taking fucking fat stacks of L's over and over again? And also, you kind of deserve to be fucking shellacked, okay? If you're paying like six hundred dollars to uh, listen to Hillary Clinton read her fucking 2016 acceptance speech that she never got to give because she got fucking absolutely dumpstered on by a clown Ten that her and her husband Amazon. originally thought would be a great person to go up against, okay, in the fucking primaries when they were like goading Trump in the running, who ran one of the worst, most ineffective campaigns in history who's like one of the most unpopular, historically unpopular politicians on the fucking planet, Why? then yeah, you deserve, if you're paying to like listen to her, then you deserve to lose that money. Okay? Just saying. I should tweet the master class. Escape that suffering. That is still a long way off. The whole future is still unknown. And she stares out at the vast country moving past her. I dream of going up to her and sitting down next to her, taking her in my arms and saying, look at me, listen to me. You will survive. You will have a good family of your own and three children. Master and as hard as it might be to imagine, your daughter will grow up and become the president of the United States. Ah, uh, no. No, she won't, bro. Ah, get fucked. I am as sure of this as Evil. anything I have ever known. America is the greatest country in the world. And from tonight going forward, together, we will make America even greater than it has ever been for each and every one What's of us. Base of Chiquita? Thank you. God bless you. And may God bless America. This is awesome. Okay. This is sick. This is fucking tight. Excellent. Excellent stuff. At least her mom didn't live long enough to see her get absolutely cumstered and dumpstered by a reality TV star. True. True. Silver lining. You know? God works in mysterious ways, folks. Damn, I like how she left in that stunt on Trump, though. I mean, this is like... Bro, I'm gonna be honest... <laughs> This is literally porn for every Republican, okay? And even some Democrats who also despise her.
eight months with my favorite himbo Hassan Abai and chat. The brain rot is coming. So many people hate her. Hassle. It's pretty great that, you know, she's just like openly showing how devastated she is. It's great. God, I hate yeah, her so much. I fucking hate her so much. Gonna get banned for showing porn on stream? True. Here you go. That's the tweet. That's it. All right. Margarine Titan Green claims that the January 6th defendants are told they have to denounce President Trump. They're told that their views are... The views of cult members, that's pretty fucking pog, okay? Treatment is unbelievable. They are told they have to denounce President Trump. They are told that they- Summary of why you hate Hillary? What? Why do I hate Hillary Clinton? I mean, I hate Bill Clinton too. She's a monster. She's like everything that is wrong with American foreign policy. She's a singular demonstration of everything that's wrong with American imperialism. And neoliberal policies. Um, she's awful in every way. She's like Joe Biden on fucking steroids. Her greed and entitlement for the nomination.